again folks, you're wondering what I'm doing here with the Scarecrow. Well, it's VE Day, it's May the 8th, 2020, and it's the 75th anniversary of VE Day. Now, being a young chap, I wasn't here obviously when that took place, the uh, v Day, VE Day itself took place, obviously I wasn't here. But my dad was in the army, he spent six years in the desert during the war, so he played his part. Uh, you're wondering why I'm sat by this fellow here. Uh, well, I don't know whether it's a scarecrow or a scare girl, actually. I asked Mrs. Scrimper and she said it's a bit of both. So you'll have to decide yourself. It's actually, a, we're having a scarecrow weekend in our village and we've made this, this to sit outside. I've also, Mrs. Scrimper's painted Wurzel Gummidge on a bit of cardboard and I've done my effort, as you can there's no contest between the two because I'm hopeless at painting, but at least I had a go anyway. And of course I've made my Scarecrow Whirly Gig, which you've seen in another video, which I should be putting outside. And I'm going to put these outside the gate in a, in a moment or two, but I just thought I'd introduce you to my friend before I did. What do you think of the hat? I made this out of a bit of old cardboard. I think it's quite good actually. I might try it on. I think it's better. Actually, we'll try it like this. What do you think, folks? Is that an improvement? Is that an improvement? A lot of people say it is. I reckon that's quite good, that hat. I wouldn't mind making one that'll fit my head. And no, I don't want any comments about my head being big. I'll put this one back on. Paddy, why is it that Paddy never... I have a job getting him to appear on camera, but when I don't want him, he's sat here all the time hassling me. I reckon he likes a scarecrow, you know. Or the scarecrow. He keeps sitting by it. I think it's, he thinks it's a person or something. Although he's not daft, he's a dog, isn't he? Paddy. Anyway, folks, I don't know why I'm rambling on, because it's not very interesting. Well, I just thought you'd like to see my new friend, that was all. Can you spot the difference, by the way? <laughs> oh, by the way, uh, before I go, what do you think of my new Scrimper UK T-shirt? I'll move up to the camera so you can see it properly. My daughter and grandson bought this for me for Christmas, about over a year ago actually, uh, not last Christmas, the one before, and I only just got round to wearing it, and you're privileged because you're the first people to actually see me wearing my official Scrimper UK t-shirt. The cops has got a picture of Paddy on the front, hasn't it? It's quite good actually, isn't it? Too good to wear, I should get it dirty. Well folks, the scarecrows are in place. That's Mrs Scrimper's Wurzel Gummidge. And over here, and this folks is Scrimper UK's effort, which I think you'll agree is a bit pathetic after Mrs. Scrimper's Wurzel Gun Edge. But at least I tried anyway. Doesn't look too bad. I'm going to show my whirly gig next. I think Paddy likes the scarecrow, folks, because he keeps sitting by it. Bye for now. If you're interested in knowing how I built the Whirly Gig Scarecrow, I have done two videos covering the subject. You'll find them both listed on my YouTube channel. Also, further down, you'll find lots of other videos on making Whirly Gigs of all types. Thank you very much for watching.